Hey everyone and welcome to the channel, my name is Ash and today I'm doing a quick review for Rise of Fox Hero on Xbox. Let's take a look. Rise of Fox Hero is a colourful 3D platformer with fun combat and puzzle elements. In the game you'll play as the fox who is armed with a sword and a shield and you have to basically jump fight and solve puzzles throughout four different chapters now across these four chapters are 32 different levels to work your way through and you'll play for a variety of colorful environments uh, all the time collecting collectibles battling a variety of different enemies and at the end of each chapter you will take on a boss so in Rise of the Fox Hero, perspective is key, so you have to make use of the rotatable camera and look in every angle to find your way through the obstacle or even find hidden secrets. So, what did we think of this game? Honestly, it's a, it's a nice little indie sort of puzzle platforming game. Now, it's not perfect, it's very basic in what it presents. You basically work through a variety of levels and in these levels you've got to collect four coins and also collect all of the apples and destroy all of the barrels. Now, you don't even have to collect all of these to progress through the story, however, to obviously get a full completion, you would want to do that. Now, the coins are hidden throughout the level. Now, sometimes they're off the beaten track or over like a more dangerous pathway, or you have to complete some sort of mini puzzle to find them so one of them is like push a ball into a hole melt so many ice blocks stuff like that now the apples and the barrels are spread out across the levels and the game itself looks pretty nice as well like i say yes it's a very sort of simple looking game and um it's not the like most sort of triple a graphics game but it looks nice and it has like a nice aesthetic to it now, at the end of each of the, the chapters, there is a boss fight, and these are sort of old school style boss fights where you have to sort of avoid their attack patterns and then attack them um, without dying. Now, you have health in the levels, but there are a variety of traps and challenges. So you could fall to your death, or you could be caught by one of the traps of the enemies enough times to die. Once that happens, you will respawn at either the start of the level or one of the sort of fires that are basically the checkpoints. Now, there's a nice variety to the levels as well with the different sort of styles, like the one you can see on the screen now in the sky. There's like tree and sort of wooded ones. There's lava levels, all that sort of stuff you would expect from this type of game. Uh, all the enemies are, are nice and interesting looking and stuff like that. It, it's just a nice little sort of puzzle platformer game. It, it's not too much and it, it doesn't do anything sort of new. But it's not that bad a game at all. Now, it's also a very easy 1000 gamer score. So, um, you're looking at 30 minutes at most to sort of get the 1000 gamer score. You only really need to sort of finish the first chapter to get all of the achievements and some of them are sort of accumulative based on like killing so many things and stuff like that but i enjoyed the amount of time i played with this game the rotatable camera is nice as well to sort of see things hidden behind sort of like higher environments and stuff like that you don't use it a lot in the early game but you will use it a lot more in the sort of later chapters Overall, this is a really fun little game, priced at a very reasonable £4.99. It was released onto the store on the 17th of February 2023, and published by two awesome partners who were kind to send us a copy for this video review. Now it's playable on Xbox One and Xbox Series X and S, supported by Smart Delivery and it's optimised for Series X and S with 4K resolution. So if you want like a very short but sweet little um, puzzle platforming game that's never going to really challenge you too much but you'll have an enjoyable time and get an easy 1000 game score, then definitely check this one out. But that's that for this video guys, hope you've enjoyed it. If you have hit that like button, hit subscribe and we'll see you soon for more content. Bye for now.